Kun State Government has distributed 10,000 boiler chickens to rural women across the state in order to assist them in setting up small-scale poultry business. The dual-purpose bird was developed in Nigeria by indigenous poultry farmers with the aim of reducing malnutrition, infant mortality rate and increased income for the less privileged. The Deputy Governor Yetunde Ononuga said the state partnered private sector on the project and highlighted the significance of women in the development of the society. Bird is a dual purpose bird. What that means in effect is that it will grow two and a half to three times the size of the indigenous bird and it will lay three to four times the number of eggs. With this, we believe that we will play a significant role in reducing all the parameters of mortality and something immunity that are plaguing our community. Empowering women means empowering the nation. Therefore, all efforts at empowering the women folk should be encouraged. This is because research has revealed to us that 70% of the population of Nigerians are rural dwellers. And the women constitute 60% of this population. It is therefore important that any effort gets towards empowering them should be encouraged. And well, we now go live to Ekiti State, where preparations are in top gear as the Minister of Solid Minerals and Development, Kayode Fayemi, is set to declare his intention to contest in the upcoming governorship election. Well, that's where we call it a wrap on TVC News this hour. For more, do visit our website. That's at tvcnews.tv. Also, join the conversation on our social media platforms using the handle at TVC News NG. Thank you for watching. I am Fadishola Shotingwa.